I am Friedel Wolf. I am a software developer here in South Africa at translate.org.za. Oh, we have been very excited about the developments here. We've really been involved in making translation tools for a number of years, and this is a natural extension of our work in this area. And we've been very happy with our progress so far, and having used it myself a little bit, I'm very happy with where we have reached so far with the program. There are a number of existing translation tools in the world of free software and we'd like to think that obviously we bring something new to the table that is of value. I'd like to think that Vertal will be simpler to use. I think being available on multiple platforms will be valuable to many users and we'd like to think that we will make it easier for people to get started, especially newcomers, to translation and localization. And obviously, we'd like it to be as powerful as anyone else out there, so that people would like to use it for whatever translation task they want to take on. For now, we are obviously focused on software localization, but we really hope that it will become a powerful tool for all sorts of computer-aided translation. Well, people are always influenced by their backgrounds. My native tongue is Afrikaans, and Vertal is an Afrikaans expression meaning for language. So we say that this tool is really written for the sake of language. But the word Vertal in Afrikaans sounds exactly like the word for translation. And therefore we have this way where the name refers to itself by saying it's for language and the tool is really for language. When we designed Vertal we really thought hard about what would be most useful for translators using the tool. So we decided to always aim for a clean and simple interface that would be easy to learn. We wanted to make sure that there is no necessity for using the mouse and that the layout would always be designed with the most frequent activities in mind so that people would be most productive doing the things that they are most commonly using. And lastly, we wanted Vertal also to be powerful so that people would have access to good computer-aided translation uh, tools without the need for complex configuration. So really powerful out of the box. We haven't quite decided exactly what would go into the next version, but we'd like to have a look at features that have made Poodle very popular, features such as terminology help, translation memory to be able to reuse your previous translations, and quality checks, which really people have come to love of Poodle, the way to really review translations for some common areas of mistakes that translators might make. I think those are the features that would make the tool really something valuable for translators. We'd like to welcome developers and translators and people that can just give their feedback, not just for Vertal but also for the other software that we develop. They can visit the website at translate.sourceforge.net and really the code is all available there. You will find some documentation on how to get involved some documentation for the programming side of things. We've got a bug tracker as lots of software projects would have and obviously you can come and introduce yourself on our mailing list or IRC channel and we'd welcome you. Perhaps next year will be the year of Vertal.